Have you ever felt you were completely lost, complaining about your job, your studies, but not really knowing what you need to do with your life? That happened with me before and led me to anxiety and depression. But then I could take the decision that changed my life forever. There must be some way out of here! I quit my job in my undergraduation for the third time and bought a ticket directly to Europe. Landed up in Lisbon and traveled by bus to the Pyrenees in southern France. That's the house I lived in for a month. I started volunteering on a farm and I learned a lot of stuff, like driving a tractor, taking care of sheep, and eating a lot of cheese. A lot of cheese. I also made a very good friend who convinced me to play on the streets with him. Take a look at this. I moved to my second volunteering, where I was taking care of horses and donkeys. I saw many things, including France burning in protests in Montpellier. In France, I also learned that you don't need to pay for transportation, you can hitchhike. And I did it a lot. I didn't even pay for one ticket in France, for three months. I kept playing on the streets, to find out that people liked my music, and I could make money out of it. Once I could make 80 euros in one hour in the food market. But not everything is beautiful. I decided to go to the Balkans, but missed the bus in Italy and needed to sleep on the streets during the winter. And finally I arrived in Zagreb, in Croatia. You have no idea how exciting it is for a Brazilian to see snow. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, leave a comment and activate the notifications from this channel. I volunteered for about a month in Croatia. This family had a Yugoslavian car called Yugo, and among my daily tasks there, I need to chop wood. It's very important to tell you guys that when I quit my job, it was not a very high paid job. After buying a one-way ticket to Europe, I had only 400 euros left. But luckily, I learned how to make money on the streets, and with something that I really love. Oh, coitado, foi tão cedo. Deus me livre, eu tenho medo. Morrer de pendurado numa cruz. In Serbia, I even decided to play on the bus. And look what happened. Still in Serbia, I made my first concert for maybe 20 or 30 people. Then I traveled to Montenegro, where I could see the most beautiful coast. Then I decided to volunteer in a hostel in Albania. There I could get even more into music. I started learning how to play ukulele and made a very good friend from Uruguay who played with me on the streets and at restaurants. Time passed quickly and when I realized I was already traveling for a year. After having traveled a lot, met different people and learned new skills, I decided to take a step further. I decided I would travel on foot. I hitchhiked, walked on highways and even got some food from other travelers who were also waiting for a ride. Met some Brazilians and made more music. <laughs> camped for the first time in my life, but it was not in a camping site, it was in a roundabout in the middle of nowhere in southern France. In the first night I was from almost being robbed to being able to see one of the most beautiful sunsets in my life. I kept walking down the coastline, found a bunker from the world war, camped in the woods, hitchhiked more got lost and camped many times kept hitchhiking camping in parks 
Can't even beside highways and walked. I walked a lot. I crossed the whole country and arrived in Belgium. Due to a lack of money and an injury, I decided to live in the park. I set my tent in a hidden place and leave it there for two weeks. All of those things I did along my journey didn't necessarily solve my problems, but showed me many other possibilities of living my life. Honestly, I still suffer from anxiety every now and then. I don't really know what I'm gonna do with my life in the future, but at least now I know I'm capable of choosing my own path. And this was the most important lesson from my travel. And now, well, time to travel again. I'm gonna walk in Portugal. Thank you everybody for watching my video and stay tuned. I'm gonna share everything from my journey from now on on this channel, Nomadic Path. Let's walk the world with me. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, leave a comment and activate the notifications from this channel.